Hey everybody, Jay Young here. Now the question came up this week from some of our subscribers. Why vertical versus horizontal? Well, how do you, what do you do to, to say, yeah, let's roll horizontal, or what do you say about a vertical? And it's all about conventional, unconventional drilling, blanket depositional. The best way I can say is, like in East Texas, if you're gonna drill those projects that H.L. Hunt came in and, and drilled, those were, un, those were mostly conventional because those were like, there's a bump, there's a bump, an upside down salad bowl, if you will, underneath the ground, and then all of a sudden you're saying, hey, there's, there's oil, if you drill a well right here, you're gonna, you're gonna hit oil right here. Like the Ellenberger project, you don't drill the Ellenberger horizontally, why? Because all you want to do is just hit the top of that formation. Here's the land, you hit the top of it, and that's all you do. That's all you have to do. Because that well's been flowing for three, four months now. It's really good, no LOEs, no nothing. It's doing 60, 50, 60 barrels a day, every day, without any touch. But if you're gonna come in and let's say, and, and, and how did Midland recreate itself, because it does recreate itself every 10, 15 years. Well, that's a blanket, that's a blanket formation. The Wolf Camp, the Wolf Camp is a blanket formation and the oil is in this thickness. And this may be, you know, 800 feet thick. There may be all these different, you know, ways in here, but, but what you want to do there is it's a blanket depositional. This whole thing is oil. All of this is oil. So why do you go in here drill a horizontal well, and then you perforate the pipe. This is the first stage of a horizontal frack. And then you go in, hit it with, with, with water, and all of a sudden, you want all of this oil right here. You want all of that oil. How are you gonna get it out of the ground? And that's by doing a multi-stage frack on a horizontal in a blanket depositional type sand that's better known for unconventional. Unconventional is the blanket depositional here, horizontal drilling works best. And then what I was talking about earlier, the conventional is like the Ellenberger well. Believers number two, where you just hit it on the top and that's all you do. If you'd have gone in there and drilled that well and then, then drilled it horizontally, it wouldn't have done anything close to what it's doing today. So a little, little tidbit on how to drill. What's better, vertical or horizontal in each project has its own its own type of scenario that you need to drill